North of 49, a guide to the rest of your life. This week on North of 49, we meet a woman who is giving back by giving time. Bobby Farr is one of nearly 2,000 volunteers involved with the TELUS Community Ambassador Program. Helping others is just one of the ways Bobby has chosen to maximize her days as a retiree. Also this week, we explore three related North of 49 compass points. We'll see how companies like TELUS are raising the bar in terms of community enhancement. We'll learn about the psychological benefits of volunteering. For many, retirement is a time to travel. Some choose to relax with a fishing rod at the cottage. Others just kick back in the old lazy boy in front of the TV. This is what retiree Bobby Farr is doing with her time. This is a program called Comfort Kits, and what it is, it's where we supply a cotton bag with basic hygiene supplies for the less fortunate. It may go to organizations like the Salvation Army that might give it out at their lunch program. It might go to transition homes where somebody got caught in a horrible situation and had to leave home without anything, and so we would supply them with the basic hygiene pro um, products. For the past few years, Bobby has been volunteering with the TELUS Community Ambassadors, a program that brings current and retired employees of the company together to give back to the community. I worked uh, as an employee for 35 years. I was in accounting mostly or billing, um, desk jobs mostly, you know, bookkeeping. Bobby retired from the company in 1996, just two years after turning 50. Nobody gives you a book or a guideline that says this is what you should do. You've retired early, uh, you're such and such an age, and you should do this, this, or the next thing. Now, I did retire, and then I was a consultant for a while. But I think the biggest thing, and, and perhaps I should mention this, is choice. When you retire, you then have choices, and they're perhaps different choices than when you're working. Do I get up today and go and have some fun and play golf, or do I go and help volunteer, or do comfort kits, or pack? backpacks for needy children or do I just go for a walk but it's a different style of choices. For Bobby, choosing to participate in the ambassador program seemed like a great way to ease into retirement. For me when I retired I then had the choice to do some consulting work which I chose to do and it was on a part-time basis it wasn't five, time a w five days a week so I chose to do that for a little while and then when I was finished with that, I chose not to do that any longer and I chose to devote more time to the volunteering activity. So again, it's choices. Bobby believes the program offers a multitude of benefits for retirees. We're lucky in, in, with our health, but I think this is what keeps us healthy in that we can be both physically active, mentally active and socially active. It also gives former employees the opportunity to keep in touch. This keeps you socially involved with the people that you used to work with and in some cases that relationship went back maybe 10, 20, maybe even longer years. And you know the other thing is it's stim it, the stimulant. My mind is still going. I'm moving physically and able to do a few things I couldn't do before. You know it's like a physical job like I call it grunt work but it keeps you mentally going as well. So I think it's, it benefits the employees as well to see that that's um, you know something that they could do if they so choose when they retire or even while they're still working. Amazingly when she's not helping out as a TELUS ambassador, Bobby lends her time to other organizations. My biggest one here is with the TELUS ambassadors. And then I have done the ALS, the ALS walk in Richmond. Uh, that was something that I was lucky enough to be involved in and started a couple of years ago. Um, I've done heart and stroke. I've done chemo crisis center out in Richmond. Bobby believes the way our retirement years play out is dependent upon the choices we make and for her, volunteering is a rewarding and truly meaningful way she has chosen to make her free time worthwhile. You um, grow old gracefully this way, or you can grow old as gracefully as you want to, or you can grow old as stodgily as you want to, or as young as you want to. I mean, this keeps you young. I'm not going to joke about it. This is fun. It's fun to be with people. And I haven't mentioned it's fun to give back to the community. We worked in a company that was uh, a good company to work for and uh, had some benefits of that. So now it's nice to be able to give back to the community and to help people and uh, you know, help where we, we live and where we work and where we still play. North of 49, a guide to the rest of your life.